Hallelujah to Jesus. I bless the name of the Lord for another triumphant and a wonderful day bestowed unto us by the mercy and the grace of God. And through the blood of Jesus this very day, I pray with you and I pray with your entire family. According to Isaiah chapter 10 and verse 27, let that word speak for you and speak for your entire household. And it shall come to pass in that day that the bedding shall be taken away off thy shoulders and thy yoke off thy neck. And the yoke shall be destroyed because of the anointing. I pray in the name of Jesus that this is the day that the Lord has made. You will rejoice and be glad in it. Every yoke placed upon your family, placed upon your marriage, placed upon your finance, placed upon your children today. Let the word of God break you free from every satanic yoke. I pray into the name of Jesus into your foundation. And I declare by the mandate of the word of the living God this very day that foundational problems, stealing away your blessings today, let it be bent to ashes in Jesus' mighty name. Today I pray that may the Lord lay his hands of protection upon your head and upon the head of your family. In the name of the Lord Jesus, upon your sons and upon your daughters, may the hand of the Lord cover everyone in the name of Jesus. Close every entrance of the enemy into your life and into your family. I pray that this day let the Holy Ghost fire destroy every evil monetary gadget place upon your life to spy your destiny and to speak against you and to sell you out. May that yoke be broken in the name of the Lord Jesus for your sake this very day. Let the blood of Jesus paralyze the link between your family and the family of evil strong men in your generation and in your lineage. Any evil strong man that have taken hold over your family that have taken hold of our marriages in your family, taking hold over the health in your family, taking hold over the joy in your family, taking hold over marriages in your family. Today, let that power break and let their power paralyze by the blood of Jesus. I pray that let the wind of disgrace and shame cover them this very day. In the name of the Lord Jesus, anyone that is making petition against you to fail, any petition of evil against your life, may it be disintegrated by the fire of the Holy Ghost. This very day, I pray that every evil secret working against you and working against your family, let it be exposed and be scattered by fire in the name of Jesus. Let the troublers of your life and family be troubled and be disgraced this day. Let the Holy Ghost fire destroy every evil personality, hiring evil weapons to fight you and fight your family. May the Lord disgrace them today. May the Spirit of God wipe and cut them off from your life. I pray that let the Holy Ghost locate and destroy evil powers in the, uh, that is hiring sicknesses and diseases to destroy your life. May their power break over your life. Today, I pray that may the Lord ordain a terrible tempest against your pursuers, against the works of darkness in your life, and against any power that will rise up against your destiny. May the Lord pursue them this day in the name of Jesus for your sake. I pray that everything, every blessing that belongs to you, that have been hid in the hiding places of darkness today, let them be exposed by fire. Let the hiding places of your enemies and in your family be tormented and let them collapse in the name of Jesus. Every evil hand and tongue raised to trouble your life and to raise to trouble your peace and trouble your family. Let that hand wither. Let that hand be roasted by fire in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Today may the Lord open the windows of heaven. May every blessing be your portion. May you be blessed going out and may you be blessed coming in. In the name of the Lord Jesus, walk in the triumphant victory of the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Through the blood of Jesus we call it done. Amen. This is Apostle Dr. Jerry Otin from Global Harvest Ministries Worldwide. Remember, you are a property of the Holy Ghost. And Satan, back off. In Jesus' name, amen.